Well, howdy, howdy. Greetings, hello. So here's an interesting project. This is a uh, JBL Sub 1500, 1500 Sub or W1500H. There was a uh, bunch of these that people purchased uh, from JBL Harmon a number of years ago. And this goes into... Uh, one of the Ravel subs and one of the JBL Big Home Theater subs. Um, and there was an issue with the epoxy coming apart on some of these. So I've been tasked to uh, repair this. Now this is, I've already, I've already disassembled it, as you can see, because the, uh, the dome typically doesn't lift off that easily so I've managed to remove the black cyanoacrylate adhesive that uh, bonds the this gigantic dome in place and I have already disassembled the uh, I've pulled the moving assembly out This is a vented gap cooling, pretty much the same motor, I believe, as a 2242 or a 2227. Um, it's got extreme excursion to it. But what happens is the, the epoxy on these, and sometimes it's the spider comes away from the spider landing there peels up it wasn't in this case but in this case the uh, the epoxy did not grab the spider too well or the uh, voice coil former so the epoxy just kind of let go because it, it didn't impregnate through the spider like it should to grab it and hold it onto the uh, voice coil former. This one also had a few uh, nicks on the voice coil winding so I coated I coated the, the entire winding with a coat of cyanoacrylate super glue. It's an industrial strength super glue so uh, to give it some extra insulation. But what I'm going to do is replace the spider there and I uh, probably have to make this into two part because I have not uh, spent any time stitching videos together to uh, edit them. So this will be a part one. Uh, so this one came to me from, I think it was Virginia. Uh, but we'll see how this turns out and I'll do part two another time. All right. Sub 1500, W1500H, Harman, JBL, Ravel, Monster Subwoofer. Boom. There it is, again. <laughs> 